Well, hey everybody, this is Eric Worry, and welcome back to NetworkMarketingPro.com. Um, we're this is part two of our five-part video series on your 90-day game plan, how you can change your life in 90 days. One of the first things that you need to do as you start with this process is you've got to create some specific goals. In other words, why are you going to do what you're about to do? Because you're going to need to sacrifice. We're going to talk about that sacrifice tomorrow and the next day and the next day. We're going to need to sacrifice over the course of these 90 days. But what are you doing this for? What is your end game? Um, some examples. You might want to do a 90-day game plan to go to a new rank. Maybe you haven't gone to the rank you want to get to, or maybe you want, you've been stuck at a rank too long, you want to break through. But sometimes a rank, maybe there's a convention coming up and you, you, you swore you're not going to you know, go to that convention unless you're walking across the stage, you know what I'm saying? You should go anyway, but you know what I'm saying? A rank advancement goal can be a powerful goal. Two, can be a team goal. Maybe you want to grow your team by 100 people or 500 people or 1,000 people or 10 people or whatever. You want to grow your team. You want to see your team rank advance. Maybe you can combine those two. How many people on your team could you get to the next rank? So it could be a team goal. Three, it could be cash. You might, just might need to make something happen. When I started in 2005, June of 2005, I needed to make, I needed money like oxygen. I had to make something happen. So when I put together my 90 day game plan, yes, rank advancement was important. Yes, team was important. But I had to get some cash coming in the door. So and you can combine these, cash with rank advancement plus your team, get your team making more money, get your team rank advancing. But you need to write all these things down. Maybe it's a prestige goal. Maybe you just want to be somebody. When I first did it in 1992, my first real 90-day game plan, I wanted to be somebody. I wanted to, people to know me. I wanted to become known in network marketing. I wanted to, to have success because prestige isn't just for you. It's for the team. Because if you have prestige, the team has more confidence to go out there and do what, it needs, what needs to be done. They could proudly say, I'm on this person's team. I'm on that person's team. So it helps with their recruiting. It helps with all of their efforts. These are just some ideas. But what you need to do is you need to write down what are your goals. If you could accomplish anything over the course of a 90-day period of time, within reason, what would those goals be? In 90 days, what would those goals be? It might be a personal recruiting goal. It might be a rank advancement goal. It might be a team goal. It might be money, financial goal. It might be prestige. It might be a lot of different things. I don't know what it is for you. But combination maybe of all of these things. But I want you, before I give you, over the course of the next three days, the three major steps to the 90-day game plan, I want you to take a minute and write this down. Write your goals down. Get them clear in your mind. What would it mean to you if you accomplished that goal? What would it mean to you if you weren't crawling in MLM any longer? What would it mean to you if your team was proud of you? What would it mean to you if you had more cash flow coming into your home? What would it mean to you get to that next rank or, or to, to sponsor 20 people? What would it mean? To you, if you make that happen. Okay? So write that down, and we're going to start the one, two, three tomorrow. Until then, ladies and gentlemen, my wish for you is that you decide to become a network marketing professional. You decide to go pro because it is a stone cold fact that we have a better way. Now let's go tell the world. That is episode number two. I'll see you tomorrow with episode number three. Take care. Bye bye.